Hey, Terrellis here. You know, if you've been following me for a while on my YouTube channel here, you may have noticed that my videos are quite lengthy. And it's not like I plan to create videos that are long. It's because I do quite in-depth tutorials and reviews about products, and it ends up being about 15 minutes to half an hour. One of the thoughts that I've always had is, you know, I just want to share a quick tip here and there and not think so much into, you know, creating these YouTube videos, which does take quite a lot of research and planning for me. And I can only at the moment handle one video a week like that. So I thought, you know, why not share a quick tip that I can share that's bite size that can be uh, implemented right away and something that you can take action right away rather than going through this 20 minute 30 minute tutorial with that said what i want to do with these quick tips every sundays i'm not sure what i'm going to call this yet and what theme i'm calling it but once i do come up with a name then i will i guess introduce it as that uh, with these sunday quick tips so for the first ever quick fire tip i want to share with you today has to do with email marketing and this applies if you already have an email subscriber base it's also going to uh, help you increase your sales and engagement by 20 30 percent that's what i personally have found and let's have, head on to the screen and i'll show you exactly what it is all right so i'm in the back end of my email marketing platform i use drip personally to build my email subscriber base I've created a broadcast email just like you would with your email marketing platform, whatever it may be. And one of the steps that you can take uh, specifically for Drip is that you can resend this broadcast to people who do not open it. This means that your email will then be resent to those who didn't open that initial or first email. So this way you're following up, but you're not annoying those people who already opened it. So if you don't want to keep following up on the same subscribers, then look out for this feature. Now, it may be called something else depending on your email platform, but look out for a way for you to segment your broadcast based on unopened uh, email newsletters. So it may be called unopened or unopens, but look for a way in this uh, platform particularly it is on the last step where right, under settings and you can simply check that box and then you can wait so and so amount of days so if it's you want to wait one day then it'll be sent out the same time but the next day and one of the tips i want to give you here is to make sure you change the subject line because your first email may not have resonated with those people. So by changing and your subject line, you might capture those people in a different perspective, in a different way. So in this case, in this segment, I've got about 10,000 subscribers that this email is gonna be sent out to. Let's say only 2,000 people open it. That means that 8,000 people have not opened your email. So it'll then resend that same email uh, to those 8,000 people instead of the, those 10,000 people originally. All right, back on the camera now, holding the mic this time, but that's the tip there. Look in your email marketing uh, platform for that unopened or recent to unopened feature. There should definitely be that feature in all email marketing platforms. If not, don't use their service anymore. Go and switch to one of the other services I recommend. I've got a video that shows the best email marketing platforms that you can use. So look out for that and look in the description for more resources relevant to email marketing. All right, that's all for this quick fire tip. What I wanna ask you is to share any questions or burning questions that you may have that you want answered, uh, feel free to comment and leave it down below. And that will actually be a great way for me to come up with topics to talk about in these uh, quick tips that I share on my YouTube channel. Thanks a lot for watching and looking forward to sharing the next quick tip with you. Stand up and